Crystal Snail. The bats from the first game. Alright, let's get the ride armor. And we're going to use this to get the hard upgrade. Now what you want to do is you want to dash jump and then you know just use the boosters. What you're, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to hold the boosters down then jump out and use like a strike chain but if you hold the boosters just a little bit and then let go while you're falling down and then use them just like very sporadically just by pressing it like this it makes them last a lot longer and then that way you can not have to use the strike chain. Right, I'm gonna get in the right armor. You break all the ice with the right armor's little arm there. You know, one up. All right, up next is a mini boss, but. I think it's very possible to skip it completely just by dash jumping. No, I guess not. I saw somebody do it in a speed run. But I'm not sure how they did it. It looks like they just jumped past it and nothing happened. I would use my Giga Crush, but I have not full yet. To fill that up, you just take damage from energy weapons. And you might hear that whee noise it's making. And it made a ding noise, which means it's full now. But he's almost dead, so I'm not going to waste it. Very annoying little mini boss, but kicked his ass. Alright, so watch out for that. Now, if you fall down here, we get our final upgrade capsule, which is the helmet. Okay, so we get the helmet, and in this game, the helmet is like a targeting system to help you find secrets. So you can just spam the little targeting weapon, so to speak, and see it'll find stuff for you. Sometimes it's rather cryptic, but usually it helps. Definitely a lot more useful than the helmet in the first game, which just broke the blocks. Which granted, you need to get the arm upgrade early, but otherwise, who cares? Okay. I notice in this game when you get the boots upgrade, Mega Man X climbs ladders like mega fast. He just speeds up them at the speed of light. You can use this spot to farm for energy capsules if you need them. Capsules. Capsules. I like how I've gotten people that have never even played GoldenEye Source or barely know VC at all to hate them. <coughs> Sonic the Jackrabbit. It's just funny how I can build up a reputation for somebody to make everybody hate him when they've never even experienced him before. Very interesting. Okay, so let's pull out the magnet mine and kick some snail ass. Using magnet mine will blow him away from his shell. Which is what you want to do, because if he's in his shell, he can do all sorts of stupid shit to you. What you want to do is you just want to kick his shell away by running into it. Yeah, he comes at you, so you gotta be sure to avoid him. So if you just dash into it, kick his shell away from him. It's like taking candy from a baby. Hunter, which we can use to get some remaining upgrades, which I'll do after I defeat Bubble Crab, who is our next victim. 
Alright, bubble boy. You are going down. 